Hi everyone, thanks for tuning in and welcome to the Kedron factory today. So we're gonna have a run through Gary and Leslie's third new Kedron. So they've got it all hitched up here behind the 70 series cruiser ute. So this one here is an 18 foot Kedron XC5 in the trademark scrub pack. So you can see the amount of solar up top. This has four 180s and 280 watt solar panels feeding into that lithium power pack. Has the island queen bed at the front. Has the center cafe dinette with kitchen opposite. And then the full separate shower toilet in the ensuite at the rear. So on the outside of the van here of the scrub pack, this one here is in the new Kedron red rust so it certainly gives a nice finish and complements in well with all of the black in the trimming so with the scrub pack it's the additional solar up top it gets that composite smooth rollover on the front and rear it has the higher die bond with that genuine rhino coating on the side of the van and then also has the Australian Dulux powder coating in a further choice of colours there as well. Electric step, so it has the electric entrance step at the door as well as also features the bolt-up alloy in the scrub protection rails there. So the top ender has those in steel as part of that hot dip galvanised chassis where the scrub pack has those in the alloy. Certainly a beautiful looking van. And as we say, Gary and Leslie's third new Kedron. So it is fantastic to see them back through. We'll open up here and just show at the press of a button. That step retracts and extends. Has that soft blue night light while I pop off the boots to stand inside and show that Cafe dinette here on the side has the bifold table. Nice and easy to fold that out as well as to fold it back in so you can have your utmost amount of table space or your room. Just pop that back over and stand back into the ensuite area. Color wise on this one here has the white in the ceiling, so that's the die bond. Above that is that Australian made thermo block insulation and non toxic insulation there. Back into the van, into the walls of the van, has the Australian made non toxic insulation in there also. So, with those solid high tensile steel punch pins. And then you can see the plastic grommet protectors that protect that electrical wiring as it goes through that aluminium frame. Back into the van here has the silver in the cupboard works. So up the top, it's a metallic in the silver, stainless steel piano hinge top to bottom, the push and twist marine grade catches. Has the microwave there with the stainless brackets to secure it in further for the off-road travel. Electronics Heartland here for the Kedrons. So the dual controller for both the aircon and the hot water system, the head unit there for the stereo. Controls or readouts here for the stator charge of the 300 amp lithium power pack as well as the water tank level indicators and temperature of the outside electronics box. Below that are the controls for the inverter charger combo unit and then also the press button circuit resetters here. Underneath is the slimline in the range hood, further LED lighting and the mains power outlet. So twin 240 volt outlets either end large stainless sink with that nice drain bowl area kedron etch in that flick mixer tap dual outlet so filtered drinking water in one washing out washing up water in the other next to that is the fan forced oven next to that is the four burner griller in the oven so that has a separate griller oven as well as the gas up top some welcome gifts there some chockies and bubbles to celebrate the new van that large window above the kitchen area, you can utilize that for also serving out the window. Around to the right, the Island Queen bed here. So that has the locally made or Queensland made bamboo pocket spring mattress underneath those welcome gifts there. Swiveling back around is the TV DVD. So that obviously goes back to the bed and to the dinette. Further storage wrapping around there with those silver front or the silver faced cupboards. 
large windows either side of the bed there. You can have those foiled blockouts down or have your midgy proof screens up if you want to take in the view and have your ventilation. You can see the size of the large window above the cafe dinette to be able to take in the view and ventilation when you wish to do so. At the moment, if it's either hot or cold or you want your maximum privacy or also your maximum insulation, you can have them up with the foils Further storage there above that cafe dinette and then that low profile aircon up top. Plenty more LED lighting. Three of the variable speed and timer. So you got a sleep timer with those in the fans to keep the air circulating around. Two door compressor fridge freezer. So plenty of space there for your cooling of your food and freezing wrapping around into the ensuite open up there with the travel lock and magnetic door close has the soft blue light there at the cassette toilet above this is the wall mount of washing machine which secures in with the noggin behind in between that interlocked aluminium frame mirror space there above the vanity so a nice ceramic mini bowl there with a the flick mixer further storage underneath and then another entrance door here to enter into the shower. So even in the 18.6, a really nice large shower, that slip and crack resistant base there made in-house at the factory here. So that's all press folded, welded and locally powder coated up to the shower head itself and that large ventilation. Swiveling back around into the van, this has the Kedron Design registered filtered compression hatch there. So that has the unique ability to be able to access that Australian made washable filter inside the cabin of the van. So when you're traveling on dirt and dusty roads, you can turn that on. And that pressurizes the inside cabin of the van with filtered air. All right, we'll pop out to the outside of the van and we'll have a bit of a look around and then we will let Gary and Leslie head off for their test tow. Cruiser ute all set up there with that back canopy. On the front of the van has the DO45 with the weight distribution hitch. Has some red piping around the protection cover we make in-house here for protecting that electric front jack from the elements. Plate alloy powder coated box there, encloses and ventilates out for the gas codes here. And then it houses twin nine kilo gas bottles, twin 10 litre jerrys there, either side with the protection plates. All that CAD design front plate alloy box. So that's all been uniquely designed for each of the Kedron models. And this one here is no different. And it has all been powder coated locally here with the local Dulux powder coating to match that red rust on the side of the van. Lockable diesel filler. It's got some lock off vents there to seal that front box off because it's all separate. Drop door for the slide out. Barbecue provision there with storage behind as well as that 300 amp lithium power pack there, all steel encased. Just looking back around has the LED keyless drop tables there. This one has the Kedron load rated alloys with Goodyear Wrangler Dura tracks, so the flagship tire for them. Underneath the van here is the protection and peace of mind of the hot dip galvanized chassis for the Kedron owners. So inside and outside that chassis has the utmost amount of protection there from the corrosion. And then the American airbags, so the Firestone airbags over there with the disc brakes all in part of that Kedron KRS design registered suspension. Here are the Kedron uniquely made food grade water tanks. So they're not imported with a cheaper plastic. These here are made in Queensland by another family business. And they're food grade for your utmost peace of mind there for your water sitting in them. And they've also got recesses there for the fittings to protect from the rocks and then the baffles there. So they allow a rock drop out, but they also provide a more stable tow. So that limits the water sloshing left to right. And you can see here overtaking a B-double truck that they do help provide a beautiful stable tow, which is absolutely paramount if you're doing extended touring around Australia. So you will see a lot of products onto the market these days. You will see copies, but there is so much involved in the weight distribution and your layouts. 
and then also forecasting or looking where weight will be loaded into the van. So, so much in these and as a nearly a 60 year family business, so much has gone into the Kedron developments over the decades to have a beautiful stable tow. Outside shower is between those twin spares. Up top is a reverse camera in between the Kedron and the XC5 badging. Down to the side of the van, you can see that Rhino coat protection. Instant gas hot water system is there. Outlet for the grey water tank underneath. Kedron alloys, you can see that nice Kedron punch into the side of that die bond with that genuine Rhino coating. Outside electronics heartland with those dust prevention buttons so you can close that off then that has that thermostat controlled fan in there that will draw that warm air out and keep that at the correct operating temperature. Stepping up top and looking back, certainly a beautiful van there for Gary and Leslie, and it is wonderful to see them through to take delivery of their third new Kedron. And we'd like to thank them very much for choosing Kedron again for their next new van to continue their travels around this beautiful country of ours. Thank you also to everyone that tunes in. We sincerely appreciate all of the support here in Australia to our great friends in America, Canada, Europe, it's uh, wonderful to see everyone tuning in and the great support. This one here is obviously the Land Cruiser Ute. Those that do tune in and know or have seen a lot with the history would know we have had the ambassadorship with Toyota Australia and Toyota Genuine Accessories for many years now. And we have been a Toyota driving family for equally as many decades Nelly has been in the business so it's uh yeah for those we uh it is great to see all the different styles and models of vehicles coming through no doubt all great in their own way uh, and for those that do question all of our ambassadorship that has been paid has gone to a spread of charities as well to help support the community all right everyone thank you once again for tuning in it's certainly a beautiful van to have a walk around and show, especially in that new red rust in the colour. Gary and Leslie, thank you very much again for choosing Kedron. On behalf of all the Gore family and the whole Kedron team, we wish you many safe and enjoyable travels continuing into the future together. All right, all, I will wrap it up here. We may catch up with Gary and Leslie on the track someday, or we might catch up with you on the next walkthrough. Thanks again for tuning in everyone. All the very best and stay safe. Cheers for now.
Thank you.